Okay, here we are with some homebrew wind spinners. This is Iron Butterfly. Finished working on that yesterday. Over here are the remnants of a commercial wind spinner, which actually works pretty well. Uh, come on, baby, give me a little spin, will you? Of course, when the wind was just blowing a few minutes ago. I think I'll try this again when the wind is more cooperative. Well, there's a breeze. I feel the breeze. Okay. Here we go. I can hear the wind turbine, if you will. Oh, look at this baby go. It's been through several uh, versions here. This is now fixed. It's a pie plate <laughs> with uh, some duct tape and uh, kind of gave it a little... Uh, strengthening with some you can see those plastic pieces from uh, a big long tie tie wrap to give it some st structural rigidity it's mounted on a sturdy sturdier than the old one uh, coat hanger which has been reshaped and it's locked into the fence so I, well, this is old faithful here this is a simple uh, we have a bamboo stick a, a piece of uh, Tie, tie wrap with hole hole in the middle and of course a golf ball cut in half not a golf ball a ping pong ball with a piece of guitar string to hold it in place a little challenge to keep these things from running away when the wind gets strong which it does here one of the latest here uh, it's a version of, a, of an earlier one in the middle is a uh, a, a part of a light mount, you know, if you want to put electrical l lighting in the ceiling, uh, works very well. This uh, this one here is simple, but it takes a bit of uh, a bit of a wind to really get it going. It'll move a little bit. And here we have not a wind spinner exactly, but as you can see, that there's a turkey feather on a stick, if you will. And again on the uh, ubiquitous bamboo pole. This works very well in terms of being a weather vane. That's what I wanted that for. You can see even in this fairly light wind, it's got a lot of leverage with that turkey feather sticking out. Can I zoom this in? Let's see, Mr. Turkey Feather. There you go. Found it in the back yard. No turkeys were harmed in the construction of this device. So, I actually have a few more, but they're not right here. Let's see if Mr. Iron Butterfly will be happy. Now, the wind is really light. If this guy is not spinning, it's uh, probably about two miles per hour right now. So, till next time. Of course, as soon as I turn it off, here we go. There's Mr. Iron Butterfly moving along with his friend. The ping pong ball and as our wind turbine. Oh, wind is picking up a little bit. This is what I was doing before I started taking a picture, of course. Go, go, go. Dun 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 had to bend that to shape and uh, do some various other things. One of the tricks with all of these is to make it very easy for them to spin. That is very little uh, you would, what would you call it? The uh, a low coefficient of static friction, right? So that it'll they'll kick off and once they get going. This guy actually works uh, nicely. Very happy with that. All right, some things make us happy. <laughs> and even this guy's spinning slowly. Okay, there we go. And where's the wind coming from? Well, the wind is from. The West. Okay, this is the remains of a farm toy. I actually bought it for a dollar. Uh, it was a tin uh, tower with a little spinner on top here, and uh, the fellow who had it, it was falling apart. It didn't work. It was sharp. It was nasty. This is what's left of it, and it does work. As you can see, the wind has to blow pretty well. Not too bad. There we go. Ooh. So this guy's mounted uh, right now on my garden fence. If 
for lack of a different place to put it. Okay, he's actually pretty good. There's one left upstairs. Okay, here is old reliable, my first wind spinner. Again, based on a uh, lighting fixture thinger, sitting on a nail. So there's a sharp point up, give it very little resistance, and as you can see, some uh, have seen better days uh, ping pong balls. Uh, this has been uh, repaired several times, but it's several years old and has held up very well. Let me give it a spin. There we go. See that spins with very little effort. This has been covered in snow and has stood up to storms. Uh, yeah, it's very close to the original design and rusted and all this still working fine. Uh, of course the wind has stopped, but it doesn't take much to get this baby going and it can spin rather quickly. It has a certain amount of mo momentum. Well here we are, at any rate, on a beautiful uh, day. Am, am I zoomed in? Yeah, let me zoom out a little bit. Here we are, Delhi, New York. Very nice. That has stood up to a while. And I guess, oh, I guess I have one more thing, which is again a, where are we? There we go, a very simple uh, weather vane. Well, what's left of it? There was a top on it, but that fell off. <laughs> so here we go. Delhi, New York, a beautiful place, and a beautiful day, even though it's January. Bye-bye.